A man who survived a crash that killed six of his family members does not yet know his family is gone. He's still in critical condition, trying to recover from his injuries. The remains of his family members have now been transported to India. Fox 4's Dan Godwin's live at Harris Health Hospital in Fort Worth, where that lone survivor is being treated. Dan? Lauren, this devastating crash took the lives of nearly an entire family. The lone survivor does not know yet that his wife, two kids, and his in-laws are gone. The deadly accident happened along Highway 67 one week ago near Cleburne. We now have photos of all six people who died in the head-on collision in Johnson County. Texas DPS says a 2014 Chevy Silverado pickup with two teenagers in Side, entered oncoming traffic in a no passing zone. DPS says the pickup hit a 2021 Honda Odyssey head on, killing six of its seven passengers. Lakesh Potabathula is the only one in the Odyssey to survive. He's here at Harris Methodist Hospital fighting to survive numerous critical injuries. Potabathula lost his entire family his wife Navina, their 10 year old son, their nine year old daughter along with the parents of Potabathula's wife. The sixth person killed in the crash as we reported last week 28 year old Rashil Barra a cousin of Lakesh Potabathula who was driving them. He was li living and working in Irving. The Potabathula family had recently moved to Georgia from Plano. They were visiting North Texas during the holiday break. The pickup was being driven by 17 year old Luke Resiker, accompanied by a passenger, 17-year-old Preston Glass. It's unclear when or if charges might be coming in this case. Texas DPS says the investigation is ongoing and those two teens remain in the hospital in critical condition. Reporting live in Fort Worth, Dan Godwin on Good Day.